everybody welcome to those checking out my channel for the very first time and welcome back to those that have been here before today we're gonna make potato soup so grab your pot and your potatoes and let's get cooking chop chop so what you'll need are five pounds of baking potatoes I use the baking potatoes because I feel like it's less to peel and it's easier to peel the larger ones than it is the real small ones and then I also have three celery stalks and I have two medium and kind of small to medium onions, but you can use one large Vidalia or yellow onion for this recipe. So now it's time to start peeling. We will fill the pot with water to cover the vegetables by one inch. I always add hot water to speed up the process a bit. And in the meantime, we will take this to the compost. While we have the potato, celery, and onions boiling, we are going to make the creamy part of the soup. We're going to mix a 24 ounce container of sour cream. With one tablespoon of flour. This will act as a thickener for the soup. We will whisk it together until it is well blended. And when the vegetables are almost done boiling, we will start taking some of the broth off of there and adding it to our sour cream and flour mixture to temper it. So, we so we'll be making the sour cream the same temperature as the broth. That way it won't separate. Check if the potatoes are ready. I use the old potato falling off the fork method. We are going to gradually add and whisk in all of the vegetable broth before combining the two. I like to smash down some of the potatoes to make it a little creamier so that not all chunky, but I do like some of the potato chunks in there. Now we will add the sour cream liquid back in. So now that we have the two mixed, we will bring the temperature back up to high and we will cook it to cook off any flour taste. Now is the time to season it with salt. I did end up using two tablespoons of salt for this whole pot. 